But first at 11, guns, homemade explosives, and a sinister plot. Police foil a plan for a Columbine-style attack at a local high school. Good evening, everyone. I'm Sandra Bookman. And I'm Joe Torres. It is the kind of threat that sends chills through the hearts of every parent of a high schooler, a Columbine-style attack. But police in New Jersey say that was the plan at Bridgewater Raritan High School in Somerset County. Now, two teenagers are under arrest. Eyewitness News reporter Carolina Lead has the details live from the newsroom. Carolina. Well, Joe, all the ingredients needed to do extensive damage. That's what investigators say the teens had in their homes. They allegedly plotted a Columbine-style attack on their classmates. Now those teens are looking at serious charges, including attempted murder and attempted widespread damage. Monday, December 14th. Investigators say that was Judgment Day at Bridgewater Raritan High School in the eyes of two teenagers. A planned Columbine copycat attack. But a student saved the day by tipping off a school resource officer about the threatening comments a student allegedly made. I'm glad that the school was able to find out and that somebody was able to speak up. Classes were immediately canceled for the school's 2,900 students Friday. No explosives were found. So the school reopened Saturday for standardized testing. Parents say administrators handle this problem flawlessly. I was very impressed that they let us all know at 12 o'clock at night that phone calls came in. We all were alerted by our Honeywell alert system. Mm -hmm. I think it was very nice that they told the entire district, not just the high school kids. And everything was very secure. We had police on the premises and we were told not to worry, so I didn't worry. Here's a look at the accused. Police first arrested a 16-year-old Bridgewater Raritan High School student. He allegedly had shotgun shells, bullets, black powder, and explosive devices. The second suspect is a 17-year-old Immaculata High senior and a competitive rifle shooter. He allegedly had rifles, shotguns, and shotgun shells. Police say the teens also drove to a home improvement store to buy PVC piping, wiring, light sockets, and bulbs. They allegedly put together explosives at the 16-year-old's home. Classmates can't believe they could be targeted by their peers. It was a little bit scary, like, hearing it this or yesterday morning, but, I mean, it's better now that we know what happened. And the students are not being identified because they are underage. There is also a search at Immaculata High School using bomb and explosive detecting dogs. That's going on before students go back to school Monday morning. Bridgewater Raritan High is open Monday. There will be a significant police presence starting then.